Hi guys, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Webdev. So we are testing the hero service call which makes an HTTP calls here. So which will be using the HTTP client library to make an HTTP calls. We are doing it. Now we are testing this get heroes without using the HTTP client testing module. I will try to show you that one in the next video also. So using the Jasmine creates by object, we will be testing this method. So now what is this get heroes method will do? It will try to make a get request using the HTTP client library for the some URL, any API URL and it will return it will, it will return the observable of heroes, area of hero it will return as an observable. Now let's try to say, test this get heroes method, the success scenario and also the failure scenario. So that means if this request has been successfully made means then it will return an array of heroes or otherwise if this if this has been failed due to the some 404 error or 500 server error or something like that, it will return error. So try to test this both the scenarios, how it will handle this situations. So first one which we will be trying to do it is the here in the spec.es. So this is the success scenario. So it should return expected heroes, HTTP client and also we need to test that HTTP client should be called only once. So fine, let's try to test this one. So here I will be writing constant. So we will try to uh, write uh, create some uh, mock response. Okay. So here I will be creating hero. It's an area of hero. Okay. And this one returns an area of data. So here I will be having ID of 1 and name of A anything. So whichever it may be you want you can do it. And here I can do ID of 2 and here you will be having name of B. Okay. So these, these are the two things which I will be trying to do it. So hero it should be imported hero fine. So this is our mock response. So let's try to uh, uh, add it to the spy object. So HTTP client spy dot get request so whoever may be calling this get method and it should return the value okay return the value so what is that return value it should return it should, it should return the uh, observable so off we should be an off okay it should be imported from this one and here i can write the expected heroes that's it so now it should it will return an observable of data why because that method will return observable of data now here i will be calling hero service dot get heroes so i am calling this service and i will be subscribing to this method so that it will return the data so here i will be having two scenarios that is nothing but next scenario so upon successfully getting the data and here so here we need to call the heroes so we will be getting the heroes here so in this method so now here i need to check whether expect heroes <clears throat> so here whatever the data i am getting the heroes so it should with context okay with context so here i can write expected heroes with expected data i am trying to check it with context expected heroes or otherwise you, you don't write it also not a problem and here i will be checking with an two equal <coughs> it should be equal with the expected heroes we whatever the data i am trying to send it and also here so we are calling this observable data so we need to expect this one right so we need to create, we need to add in here done function. So this when then when this done function is called, then only this uh, this test case will be completed. So here we will be calling this done method. If you don't write this done method means, so here it will call and it will end the testing scenario. And here if you are getting this error means, so here if you are having an error means, then you can tell that this is a done dot fail. Okay. So why? Because it should not get to the error request. That's it. Fail the test if an error is executed. So here we have expected this one. That's it. So now and also you can also check another scenario in such a way that this get heroes should be called right. Expect of HTTP client spy object. Okay. Dot get dot calls. Okay. Calls dot count. So it should be count. Count should be equal to to be one so it should call only one time that's it so now here this is the success scenario so if you want to check this success scenario so you can call this uh, the command that is nothing but npm test so we can call this npm test let's try to see whether we can able to test this scenario or not let's try to check it so it will take some time to test the scenarios it will open the karma test runner tool let it open hey guys if you try to see here so you will be able to see that it should return expected heroes HTTP client call once. So the test has been passed here, but this one, the specs has no expectations. It is saying why? Because so we haven't implemented that one. So let's try to implement the error scenario also. So here you'll be able to see. 
and another oh, sorry okay let's try to click on this one so i'm just i'm clicking okay so here it should return ex, uh, expected services zero service it's done so now let's try to implement the another one that is nothing but uh, the error scenario so how we can implement this error scenario let's try to implement this error scenario also then we can close this session so here the error scenario which you will be able to see this one is so here this is the error scenario now so then now we should not uh, the, now there is no need to add this expected hero scenario and all those things so just we need to have an error response so let's try to create an error response for this one so constant error response sorry error response sorry error response is equal to new http error response so you can have it like this and here i will be trying to send the error so the error which we will be trying to send it is the uh, test 404 error so i am trying to send it and here i will be trying to check the status which is of type 404 okay and i will be using the status text okay and the status text is not known so just we can have this simple example now what i will be trying to do here <coughs> okay so now we need to send the error for this one so here we need to send the error so how we can send this one is um, how we can send this one is so here we can use something like HTTP client spy dot we need to call the get method and it should return the value dot return value so what it should return you should return the throw error so what type of error it need to throw that is nothing but um, error response that's it so throw error of error error response that's it so now this is the method this is the thing which it needs to throw throw error of error response fine so now we are throwing the error response now let's try to call this one so here i will be calling hero service dot get heroes okay we are calling this get heroes now when we are calling this get heroes so we will be having the subscribe method that's a common thing and we will be having the next method so when it goes into the next method means so we know that it should be failed done dot fail so here we should have a done function whenever you are having this uh, what i want to say asynchronous calls or something like that means so then you need to have a done done dot fail of if you want to have expected an error not success so this is the thing and if you are having uh, another one something like okay here you will be you need to call the method okay then only you will be able to get so now here you will be having an error So here you can have error so this is the error which you will be getting and here i can do expect dot uh, expect of expect of error dot message so which you will be able to get the message dot to contain okay and this is the error message which you will be able to see test corner for error so you can write it directly like this that's it and also you can call the done function okay and that's it so this is all about this one so here if i try to uh, check the scenario so here it is working fine and here if you try to see um, if i refresh this page now you should be able to have a expect scenarios so http failure response unknown you are 404 not found to content test 404 error okay 404 to content test 404 error so error dot message so here what it would be expecting so here what what is the error what is the message we have written it could be something wrong i think let me check error dot message to contain so what is this one HTTP field response of our unknown url 404 not found to contain okay we are getting 404 not found i think okay fine let's try to write this one only uh, nothing not going to happen let's try to see the output scenario for this one yeah now it has been passed the hero service also has been passed so this is how we will be checking this one so now what i want to tell you is <coughs> now what i want to tell you is so here what we have did the test setup so let's try to understand the clear one by one the test setup so which we have created that uh, jasmine that creates spy object if you try to see here we have created a it will create a spy object for http client with a get method and hero service initialization so we pass the mock http client to the hero service constructor 
so we have to do it and success scenario testing the success scenario simulate a successful http get response with this with the uh, here off function with an observable data and we are verifying that whether the return heroes matching the expected heroes and the get method on the spy was called exactly once or not and the error scenario what we are trying to do here we are simulating the error response 404 and we are verifying the error handle captures the error message as expected and the test fails if the service unexpectedly returns the heroes so now this is how we are trying to do it so now here the key concepts what we need to do it is spice we have used the jasmine spice to mock the dependencies and simulate their behavior and observable testing subscribing to the observables allows you to test both success and error scenarios and another one is validating the results and checking the spy methods of where called the expected number of times or not so this is what we will be trying to do it so hope you understood about this concept if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you